Hello, sports fans. It's me, Sportsman Z, Bob Zolke. And today, we're going to talk about Eduardo Escobar and the possibilities that the White Sox will bring him to Chicago. <laughs> So if you've been, uh, I guess, if you've seen some of the chatter on Twitter, on Facebook, um, some of the trade rumors on MLB trade rumors, you know that the White Sox are interested in um, obtaining the services of Eduardo Escobar from the Diamondbacks. So um, I, this is not by any means a done deal. And in fact, I don't think that the White Sox have even made a solid offer to the Diamondbacks for um, Escobar yet. He also right now is fighting through uh, a minor injury. So they would be trading for somebody who might not even be able to play right away. So I'm not sure how likely this is to happen. Now, that having been said, the White Sox did look into the possibility. They are um, interested in obtaining him as they are probably interested in obtaining other the services of other major leaguers on other rosters of teams that won't be contending this year, as they should be because we have suffered a lot of injuries lately. Escobar, now Escobar really this year, right now, he's got a slash line of 253, 298, and 779. He doesn't get on base a lot, he doesn't hit for a high average, but he does have 17 home runs. So that's, um, I mean, don't get me wrong, I take it because we do need somebody We've suffered um, infield injuries to, um, to Madrigal and, uh, well, really just Madrigal, but he was, the second, he was the starting second baseman. So now it seems like we have a rotating second base uh, out there for the White Sox between Mendick and Garcia and um, whoever else can... You know, says I guess even says that they can play second. So we do need um, somebody. And talking to Escobar, that's you know talking to the Diamondbacks about Escobar, that's fine. I think we should also be talking to the Pirates about uh, Frazier. And I don't normally do this because I know the White Sox aren't listening to what I say. So normally I won't speculate on who they should go out and get, what they should do. But I think it's apparent that we need somebody to get us through this, this uh, uh, rash of injuries that we've suffered lately. So they should be talking to the Pirates about Frazier, maybe even Reynolds, an outfielder who we could certainly use. Uh, but they should be talking to other teams. And I'm sure they are. I'm sure they're aware of the situation and that they know that they need somebody solid to play second base and at least one more outfielder, and probably could even use another arm in the bullpen. So hopefully the White Sox are aware of that, but if I am and other fans of the White Sox are aware that they need these things and that they need to do this or try to do this, I'm sure the White Sox are too. So uh, I mean, that's all I wanted to say on the subject. Um, I'm not sure how likely it is we actually get Escobar, but even if we do, it may be still another couple weeks off when he can get through his injuries all right and, uh, and, and maybe we've, we're done exploring other options, potentially. But what do you guys think? Do you, uh, have you heard that we're going after Escobar? Um, it was definitely on trade rumors, but I haven't seen anything else anywhere else indicating that it's an imminent 
thing that it's going to happen really soon. But let me know what you heard. Leave a comment below. Give me a thumbs up if you liked the video. Who else do you think we should go after besides maybe Reynolds and Frazier? Um, you know, I could tell Marte maybe. Um, let me know in the comments below. But that's it for me, Sportsman Z, Bob Zolke, signing off.